Hi everyone, this is Dr. Stefan. Welcome to another video in which I'd like to just briefly comment about why don't they make tablets and pills to treat respiratory disease. And we keep getting all these new and fancy inhalers, all these kinds of little things. So it can be answered uh, very quickly easily this question if we think about the fact that we need to have a medication that needs to target the inner lining of the airways so basically that's the reason why we have inhalers and all these strange devices that have been invented in the last few years because if we are trying to treat the inner lining of the airway we want to get a high enough concentration of medication in that inner lining of the airway to treat for example airway inflammation as in the case of asthma it makes sense to just inhale that medication directly where it's needed to act so within the airway, so in the breathing tubes, and then it acts locally. Because if we are taking a tablet, if we swallow a tablet, what would happen? It goes through the esophagus, goes into the stomach, goes into the gut, gets dissolved. The medication gets absorbed through the gut wall, into the bloodstream, passes through the liver, passes through the rest of the body circulation, and eventually ends up on the outer side of the airway tree, where the blood vessels are and then from that uh, outer those outer blood vessels the medication needs to diffuse through the airway wall to the inner lining where it will eventually act so we're taking the long convoluted way and you can imagine that in order to achieve a good enough concentration of the medication that would be effective to act on the inner lining of the airway we would need a high concentration because the medication will get distributed throughout the body in a high volume of distribution. So this is why pharmacologically it makes more sense to try to inhale the medication in the airway. We need a much lower dose of total drug in order to act effectively. So this reduces the risk of side effects. It acts locally, so there's very little medication absorbed in the rest of the body. There's very little interactions with other medications that you may be swallowing for other conditions, there's a less uh, chance. There's less chance of off-topic, uh, off-target uh, effects. So basically, this is the simple explanation. I didn't think that there's much more to add at this point, but if you have further questions, do leave them in the comment section below, and I'll try to clarify things further. Hopefully, this was helpful. All the best and good health.